Give me a number of players. Mm. Four, or five, four or five for time's sake. Let's say four. So and I where do you want to sit? One, two, three, or four. You're my secret partner. One. Number one. One, two, three, and we said four players. So you chose number one, two, three, four. And you chose number one. Now watch this. Right before I deal the next card, mix them up or cut them since your hands are tied up. You just set those aside. Do anything to the deck you want. You can even take cards out if you want. Oh, just take them out? It's up to you. Do whatever you want. Just mess up those cards in any fashion you want and then give me the cards back when you're done. Make you keep everything and where they belong. There you go. Okay. So in, the, in other words, I'm letting you do whatever you want to make things as difficult as possible and cut the deck quickly. Just cut it, put the other half on top. Okay. Uh, very good. So you chose number one and you shuffled and cut. What's that card? Nine of spades. Nine. Nine and you chose player number one. What's that card? Ace of diamonds. What's that card? King of clubs. And you chose number one. What's that card? Ten of diamonds. And we have the last card, which is called down and dirty. And you shuffled and cut. You chose four players. You chose to sit at number one. I let you shuffle and cut, even shuffle in the middle of the deal. And we're playing seven card stud. We always play what's called high, high Chicago, which means high spade in the hole automatically wins half the money. So again, what's that card? Ten of diamonds. Ten. King of clubs. King. Ace of diamonds. Ace. Nine of spades. Nine. <laughs> uh, queen of spades. Queen. Queen of hearts. Two queens. We're playing high spade in the hole. What's that? Ace of spades. Half the pot. So you have aces and queens, which with four players, that's all you need to win. You don't want to overkill. You just want to get the money. But the point is you shuffled, you cut, you chose four players, you chose where you wanted to sit. And in the time I dealt, I took care of business for you. Watch the three on top. I deal it really slowly. So the dealer will hit the other players. And only when I'm ready do I deal the three. Watch face up. So the card sits there as the second card is dealt. And this is completely exposed for you. There's one handed thing. And when the three is face down, when it's face down, it's hard to tell that you've been swindled. But that's called dealing seconds. Have you ever heard that expression? Pick a number. Three. And you'll be my secret partner. Do you want to sit at one, two, or three? Two. Number two. And as I said earlier, the only way you're allowed to shuffle in the casino is you have to keep the deck face down on the table. Riffle shuffle. You're supposed to do what's called a strip cut. And you want the second position at a three-player table. And I'm going to let you deal to see if I did it. Deal to take the deck. Deal the card off the top, face up right here, player one. And the card you chose with three. Face so up? Face up. Deal the card here, face one. up. So you know, face up number two is you. What's that card? Three. Player three. Start here, player one. Player two is where you want him. What's that card? Three. Player three. Player one. You chose two. What's that? Three. Player three. Player one. You chose two. What's that? Three. Wait, you win. <laughs> but the point is I shuffled your cards back in the deck exactly where you chose every third uh -huh. position, started at number two, and you dealt them to prove that it happened. Okay. I haven't even... Um, three of spades. Take out all the threes. There. Okay. Hand me all the threes face up. And what was your favorite? Spade? Spade. Pull the spade. And I'll leave the other three threes here on the bottom, okay? One of the cards escape. Okay. Are these all face down? Those are face down. This is face up? These are face up. Okay. And then make sure the threes are still on the bottom. Mm -hmm. Yes, I just didn't want you to think I tried to do something tricky there. Hand me the three of spades face up. Watch the three of spades. The gambler wants the three of spades, so what happens is the dealer will pitch cards to the other players, and only when I'm ready, I deal the three of spades. Watch, so the, what happens is I deal the card under the top, and then when I'm ready, that's when I'll deal the three of spades. And they're not off the bottom, the other threes haven't moved, and the first card was not a three.